A friend of mine, Tom, sent me an article about late night eating and its relationship to obesity. And there is some research that's been out about this for a while. And there's a couple of areas that are quite interesting. One, of course, is the latest possible night eating, eating which is the people, uh, which, which reflects the people who are actually eating in their sleep. There's actually a disorder that is a sleep eating disorder. And some of these people wake up in the middle of the night. It's been described for people with sleep apnea, people who use Ambien, and just people where it's called a parasomnia. There's no, there's no obvious explanation. Um, so there's that really extreme form, and that's exactly how some people do gain weight and don't realize it. There's other types of uh, late night eating, which is, which is much more common, and that is the, the issue of uh, eating late into the evening or close to bedtime. And there is some uh, emerging research suggesting that this may uh, interfere with circadian rhythms uh, or other factors in terms of the way we metabolize uh, food you know, during the night. Obviously, there's people who have to eat late in the evening. For example, if a diabetic is using insulin and has to be on a very specific regimen uh, for their insulin and has to have a, a bedtime snack, then that's very understandable. But I think it's interesting that there will be more research in this area because the whole area of sleep, circadian rhythms, and obesity is something that's going to be very fruitful for our understanding of these problems and how to help people to lose weight.